Hi, this is Aaron with Card Access again. This is the second video on wiring up the heavy duty power controller. In this video, we're going to talk about uh, setting up the HPC for a 240 volt load. This is probably going to be the most frequent setup you'll come across. Uh, this would be used in applications such as a water heater, a pool pump, a fountain pump, or something that requires a heating element. And just to remind you again, this should only be installed by a professional licensed electrician. So to wire up a 240 volt circuit, what we're going to do is we're going to send one of the hots down the white wire. You'll notice that on both of these, I've marked the white wires with a black mark so that if, if anyone's working on this later, they'll see that this is in fact a hot wire and not a neutral. So the way it comes in, we have both hots coming in, both feeding our power supply. The HPC can run on 240, so they both go in there. Uh, one will go into a wire nut, and we'll run that guy all the way over to its own relay. And then these three are all the same terminal block. So we can run one of these uh, out to one of these, uh, to the each relay. And then out here, they'll go both go to the load, which is the opposite side of these relays. If you want to set up the HPC permanently in a 240 volt mode, you can see here the dip switches, we've got them all set to on except for this second dip switch, which is off. And that will lock it into a mode where both relays will always open and close together. You can still add it into C4, but when the dip switches are set like this, it basically prevents it from operating in any other way except for the 240 volt configuration. So this is another scenario for the 240 volt load. This one's not as common, however it is useful for any scenario that requires the neutral to come uh, back through, such as an oven or a range where the heating element is uh, 240 volts, but the control panel is only 110. So on the 110 circuit the neutral is required to uh, come back through. So basically we wire this, uh, the HPC itself will run off 110 volts, so we've got our input hot these three once again still linked together. Uh, out of the linked block we go to the first relay. Out of the first relay we go into our output to the load. The other hot can go straight to the second relay then right back out of it. Then our neutrals are all tied together. So the neutral that provides power to the HPC, this one comes back from the breaker and uh, one comes back from the load. The dip switches are set the same as the standard mode as well. 